Good morning, everyone. I'm here in Thacker Pass, Nevada. This is a site that is threatened by uh, the planned construction of a vast open pit lithium mine. So everything you can see behind me uh, is under major and imminent threat of being blown up. Uh, this mine is being resisted. Uh, I've been out here off and on since uh, really October of 2020 and uh, set up camp out here and started spending a lot of time here on January 15th of last year, 2021. So um, <clears throat> the concerns with this mine are many and they include uh, the destruction of the land, uh, very vital habitat for some threatened and endangered species, uh, the harms to sacred sites and very culturally important sites to the indigenous people of this region, and harms to water. And uh, right now we're in the watershed of the Kings River Valley and the Quinn River Valley. Those uh, waterways are already over pumped. Uh, farmers are taking way too much water from those aquifers already. And so the land is going dry here. There's a major state of drought. And this, uh, this mine would use 4.6 million gallons of uh, water per day for its mining operations and uh, you know pollute a lot of that water as well as well as directly harming uh, the groundwater flows and springs in the area uh, and interrupting the water cycling that's provided and the filtration that's provided uh, and done by the, the land and the, the plants and animals who live here. So we want to fight this project, we want to stop it and we want to protect the water. Um, the, the water is crucial for all the life out here. Nevada is the driest state in the country. And this is uh, really essential uh, for the Lahontan cutthroat trout who live back in these mountains here. Uh, federally listed threatened species. And uh, the Kings River Purge, a snail species who only lives in the springs over here on this mountain. Um, so I hope folks will support what we're doing out here. Check out Protect Thacker Pass uh, for ways that you can get involved in support. And thank you for watching.